Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of The Originals. Today we'll be watching episode 3 of season 5. Um, I'm gonna butcher it. Nenme Kwete Pass. Um, don't know what it means, but I'm very excited to dive right in. By mistake again, I read the uh, the description of the, the episode. Um, it's something to do with Elijah, so I don't think we're gonna sort of touch up on what we saw in the previous episode. Uh, nevertheless, I'm super excited to see how uh, everything works from here on out. And yeah, let's not wait any further, let's just dive right in. In this time, does he know he is Elijah, like his name is Elijah and that he's a vampire? Does he know that or does that all like still remain and just doesn't know who his family is? <laughs> Oh dear. Only you, Elijah, even after compulsion, you still remember your manners. Your discipline of folding. Oh my god. Well, the aftermath of seven years ago. Let's watch it. What the hell do you want from me? Are there more of us? Where, where do we come from? What, what are we? Whatever game you're playing, I'm not interested. Does she know him? Of course she must. You've never heard of vampires. Story. Oh, she doesn't know who he is. Uh, folklore. Do I look like folklore to you? I miss Elijah. It would sound like a thud, but we hear the crisp cracking of varnish splitting off the wood. Tiny staccato echoes as the sound hits pockets where sap once flowed, and the thunderous boom of the metal legs vibrating against the floor. I think I can see a man, and he is saying my name, but I can't remember my name, and I cannot remember this man's face. Oh, it's a pleasure to meet you, Antoinette. Antoinette, my lord. Thank you. Fancy name. You've never compelled. Oh, you are in for a treat. <laughs> Just by looking deep into someone's eyes, you can make them do whatever you want. Wait, is that what you were doing when I found you? I don't know. What is that? I know I didn't write it. What does it say? Don't look back. <laughs> I mean, I just take you someplace nice and I promise to get you home by midnight. <clears throat> Sounds wholesome. Elijah, you're breaking my heart. Surprise. I found more of us. I'm just gonna get another shot. Why is she scared? I appreciated the gesture. But what? I don't do group feats. Besides, vampires like that have a thing about vampires like me. Their rules ground me. It's the only way that I've found happiness. You're all right. You want peace of mind. Accept who you are now. My death was brutal. Tied to a stake and stoned by my village. I wouldn't wish that on anyone. But I'm in control now. When they die, their bodies are flooded with hormones. Terrify them and you're drinking from a well of cortisol, blood tainted with fear. I haven't tasted that fear. That's all you've ever tasted. This is so weird! Okay, you know what, lady? You're great, I guess. Sure you are, good personality. What the hell are you doing here? Shit, yeah, there is in New York City with Marcella. 
off. Go now, or I'll kill you both. That was him. That was the man in the face that I couldn't remember. Elijah. This road of yours, it's dangerous. Who knows where it ends or what you'll find out along the way. It's okay. It was nice sharing New York City with you. after this but just go you're joking madam it's like you two were meant to be for each other I knew that obsessing about my past can brings me nothing but misery torment if you're happy I'm happy Elijah I'm gonna say that that If he's happy, then I'm happy. You've treated him well. You've taken good care of him. I suppose I should be thanking you for going to reject his proposal. And then... Oh, Klaus! ...this bar and my brother's life forever. When I came here, I tried to force myself to forget you. To stay present. There was a man waiting for me in the kitchen. Oh! He tried to compel me to walk away from you forever. He said that he's come to take you home. So she takes Vavain. Your name is Elijah Michelson. You may not remember yourself or your family, but we need your help. Our family is in crisis. I've come to take you back. To we made a vow. Always and forever. He's talking about somebody else's life. No, this is still your life. You have no idea the risk I'm taking simply by being here. There are consequences to us being together. Don't you see? Don't leave! That my daughter's life was worth saving. Ah! Oh. You love me? Ah! Think you know me, or Rebecca, or Cole, or Freya, or Hope, or even Haley, but we are your family. Everyone you love needs you now. Everyone I love is right here, but I know all about you. Rebecca, Cole, Freya, Hope, and even Haley, and I don't care about any of you. A thousand years. Elijah Michelson spent every day of his wretched life trying to save you from yourself. I mean, I can't even imagine a more miserable existence. I worship every single dawn that I spend here, here, where I'm truly, truly loved. But it means nothing without family, without purpose. Please, Elijah. Elijah Michelson is dead. We really need to get moving. You knew that Klaus is an original? You knew a steak wouldn't kill him? I knew exactly who you were. That's why she ran. The stories about your family are legendary. You have enemies all over the world. We choose who we are. Every day, every moment. I learned that a long time ago. So to renounce that family, to renounce him the way that I did, I saw it. I watched the light vanish in his eyes. He's gone. 
Who is Haley? Someone Elijah Michelson used to love once upon a time. <laughs> you heard me? Yes. A thousand times yes. Wow, shocking. Bye, Elijah Michelson. I did say that if Elijah's happy, I'm happy. But I completely take that back. I don't like this, Elijah. I know it's part of the story. I just cannot. Oh, God. What is this? I, you know. Oh, God. So in present day, completely he, Klaus. I genuinely did not know which present day it was. As I said, I'm getting messed up with the time. Like, not so messed up with the timelines. I'm just thinking that present day meant when... Um, you know, when Klaus came to the bar for the first time and saw him playing the piano. I thought it was that day, but a couple of days before and that like, Klaus might kill um, Antoinette. And yeah, that's how the story would go. But um, completely the opposite. I can't believe Elijah is deep into this lifestyle now. He burnt himself to say goodbye to his old self. If this isn't Shakespeare, I don't know what is. Oh, God. Uh, I mean, I guess. I guess, I guess. But, yeah. What, um, what Elijah said about Klaus, like, you know, that he knows that Klaus is completely, like, gone. He will not come back. And when he said to Freya, so, oh, God. I really hope that somehow he comes around in time to find Haley and... I don't know, I'm pretty sure or not, but I just truly hope that everything will be fine in that regard. I I don't know. I I don't know how I feel. It's very weird for sure to watch this side and that he's completely forgotten about I mean it's not his fault. Well, he did ask for it, but at the same time it's not his fault that he's gone down this route. But it's just so the change is like quite it's, it's a bit much, but yeah, let's see what happens in episode four. Still don't know what the title means. Neme quit pass regarding this episode. So yeah. Um, anyhow, I'll see you guys in episode four. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Please don't forget to wear masks and stay safe for your friends and family. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.